All right, so the last feature I want to show you is how to do the swept, uh, the swept feature. So what we need to do is we need to select the feature sketch one and the other feature, which is the 3D sketch. And then we're going to use a um, feature manager, which is a part of the model uh, in order to create a or call a function that's called insert protrusion swept three. And um, the thing is, we can't really select these um, sketch types uh, like we did in the previous ways here. Uh, we have to use the select by ID. So let's uh, start by selecting these features. So we do model dot extension dot select by ID two. And the first thing we're going to select select is the sketch one. Sketch one. And this is the name. So you can check the name by going into SolidWorks here and see what the actual sketch is called. So this is sketch one. So sketch one and then the type is a sketch. All caps sketch. And the position can be just zero zero zero. Append as Boolean. This is false because this is the first selection. Mark as integer zero, call out nothing. And select option as integer zero. Okay, and then model dot extension dot select by ID two. The other one is called 3D sketch one. So 3D sketch one which is a sketch also zero 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 and append true you want to append the selection mark zero nothing and zero and let's debug this start and run through see here what we did we selected sketch one, good. And we selected successfully the 3D sketch as well. Great, exit the debugger. Okay, so in order to access the uh, um, uh, features that we can create, we need to create a feature manager. So we can do dim feature MGR as and this is a a feature manager which is equal to model dot feature manager so in the same way as we did with the sketch manager we create a feature manager now we can access the properties inside feature manager so feature manager dot insert probably so if it's not in, in create, it's probably an insert. Insert protrusion swept three. And this takes a lot of um, arguments. So propagate as Boolean. Uh, you can experiment with, with this, but just do false here. Uh, I don't know what all of these do. Alignment as Boolean, set it to false. Twist control option as short zero, keep tangency as boolean. Um, yeah, sure, true. Be advanced smoothing as boolean. False. Start matching type as short zero and matching type as short zero is thin body as boolean false. Thickness as double zero, thickness is double zero. Thin type as short zero, path line as short zero, merge as boolean, set this to true. Use feature scope as boolean, false. Auto select as boolean, false. Twist angle as double zero, B merge smooth faces as boolean, false. Okay, let's see what we did. Start a debugger. 
there's the feature manager and there you go so this worked and these options that we have uh, seen here are related somehow to all of these options here so if you want to know what you're doing exactly with this you can ch check out the API for that but this works